the numbers have begun to tighten as we approach election day amid crises affecting both Democratic contender Hillary Clinton and her Republican rival Donald Trump. Use our tracker to follow the contest and scroll down to find some explanation on what the polls show. The BBC poll of polls looks at the five most recent national polls and takes the median value, i.e., the value between the two figures that are higher and two figures that are lower. He bad news for Hillary Clinton is that the polls had already begun to tighten both nationally and in some key battleground states before FBI Chief James Comey announced a new inquiry into her email use. Some form of early voting is in place in most states across the U.S., meaning much of the electorate will have cast their ballot before Election Day. Although those votes are not counted until polls close on Tuesday, some states release data on the number of early votes and how many were from registered Republicans or Democrats. Donald Trump has been hit by several scandals since his campaign began. The most notable was the release on October 7 of a video in which he can be heard boasting about sexually assaulting women. He said his comments were just words and denied ever having growthed a woman but several have since come forward alleging just that. Dot as election day approaches, Donald Trump is being increasingly outspoken about the polls, describing those that show him behind as dirty and accusing polling companies of tremendous dishonesty. Dot yes, a tough task to gauge the mood of a nation that is home to more than 300 million people but that doesn't stop the pollsters from trying. We be identified 13 states that can be considered battlegrounds in this election. The map below shows them and which way they're likely to vote based on data collected by polling resource website RealClearPolitics.no. They're the only candidates that stand a real chance of winning the race but there are other candidates in the running. The rules around getting on the ballot differ from state to state but most voters will have to name alternatives to Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump.